Have you ever wondered about the geopolitical dynamics of Asia? An intriguing question indeed. Asia, a continent of diverse cultures, economies and political systems, is home to some of the world's most influential nations, including India, the Philippines and China. The relationships between these three nations are as complex as they are fascinating, interwoven with historical narratives, economic interests and strategic necessities. Let's take a moment to delve into this intricate web of diplomatic ties. On one hand, we have China, a global powerhouse with a rapidly expanding influence, extending its reach in the South China Sea, a region of significant strategic importance. This expansionist stance, however, has raised eyebrows and concerns across the Asia-Pacific region, particularly in the Philippines. The Philippines, an archipelagic country with a long history of territorial disputes with China, finds itself in a precarious position. Despite diplomatic efforts, tensions have been escalating, leading to a cloud of uncertainty looming over the South China Sea. The question is, where does India fit into this complex equation? India, a rising global player, has maintained a delicate balance in its relations with both the Philippines and China. While it shares long-standing cultural and economic ties with the Philippines, it also has a nuanced and sometimes contentious relationship with China. This delicate balance is further complicated by India's strategic interests in the region, which are intertwined with the security and stability of the South China Sea. As the stakes rise in this geopolitical chess game, the role of India becomes increasingly pivotal. Will it play the mediator, the neutral observer, or will it side with one against the other? And what would be the implications of such a decision on the geopolitical landscape of Asia? These are the questions that we'll explore as we delve deeper into this fascinating topic. But what if war breaks out between the Philippines and China? Where would India stand? So, join us as we unravel these complex dynamics and keep your curiosity piqued. What are India's strategic interests in the region? A question that deserves a closer look. You see, India's position in the Asia-Pacific region is not just geographical, but also economic, political and security oriented. Let's start with the economic aspect. India's thriving economy is heavily reliant on the seas, with over 90% of its trade by volume being seaborne. The South China Sea, which is adjacent to the Philippines, is a vital maritime route for India's trade. A strong alliance with the Philippines could ensure safer and more secure trade routes leading to economic stability and growth. But it's not just about the economy. Politically, India has been actively pursuing its Act East policy. This policy aims at boosting India's ties with the countries in the Asia-Pacific region. The Philippines, being a key player in the region, naturally becomes a crucial link in this chain. An alliance with the Philippines could significantly strengthen India's political standing in the region. Now let's talk security. The increasing assertiveness of China in the South China Sea has been a cause of concern for many countries, including India. The strategic location of the Philippines right in the heart of the South China Sea makes it a potential ally for India. An alliance would not only provide India with a strategic advantage in the region, but also act as a counterbalance to China's growing influence. So as we delve deeper, it becomes clear that India's strategic interests in the region extend beyond just geography. They're intertwined with its economic prosperity, political ambitions and security concerns. An alliance with the Philippines could potentially tick all these boxes, making it a win-win situation for both countries. Could India's interests align with those of the Philippines in case of a conflict with China? Well, given the strategic interests that we just discussed, it seems quite likely. But as always, only time will tell. What could a Philippines-India alliance look like? Now that's a question worth pondering. A Philippines-India alliance would likely be multifaceted with military cooperation, economic ties and political support all playing significant roles. Let's break it down a bit, shall we? Starting with military cooperation. The Philippines and India could pool their resources to bolster their defenses. India, with its well-equipped military and strategic location, could provide the Philippines with much-needed support in the event of a conflict. The two nations could share intelligence, conduct joint military exercises, and collaborate on defense technology. This would not only enhance their military capabilities, but also send a clear message to any potential adversaries. They're stronger together. Next, we have economic ties. Both the Philippines and India are rapidly growing economies, and there's ample room for mutual benefit. 
Increased trade, investment and joint ventures could help both nations prosper. It's a classic case of the whole being greater than the sum of its parts. Lastly, political support. This is perhaps the most intriguing aspect of a potential Philippines-India alliance. Both countries have had their share of tensions with China, and an alliance could serve as a powerful counterweight. By presenting a united front, they could negotiate from a position of strength and influence regional politics in their favor. But what does all this mean for the balance of power in Asia? Well, a Philippines-India alliance could shake things up, to say the least. It could potentially realign alliances, shift power dynamics, and reshape the geopolitical landscape. Imagine a scenario where the alliance between the Philippines and India becomes a beacon of cooperation, a model for other nations. It could inspire similar alliances, creating a network of partnerships that stand in solidarity against any form of aggression. Of course, this is all hypothetical. Such an alliance would have to overcome numerous challenges and navigate a complex web of geopolitical considerations. But it's a possibility worth exploring, don't you think? How would such an alliance influence the balance of power in Asia? Well, that's a question for another day. For now, let's just say that it could make things a lot more interesting. Stay tuned for the next scene where we delve into military capabilities. Before we move forward, hit subscribe for insightful content. Now let's get back to our discussion. How would the military capabilities of India and the Philippines stack up against China? A question that might seem daunting, but let's delve into it. The military capabilities of a nation are a complex matrix of factors, including the size of their armed forces, the quality and quantity of their equipment, their technological prowess, and their strategic doctrines, among other elements. In the case of India, the Philippines and China, each brings its unique strengths and weaknesses to the table. India, known for its sizable army, is one of the top military powers in the world. It boasts a robust arsenal of advanced weaponry, a strong air force armed with multi-role fighter jets, and a navy that includes aircraft carriers and nuclear-powered submarines. India's military capabilities, paired with its strategic geographic location, offer a significant counterbalance to China. On the other hand, the Philippines, while not a military superpower, has been modernizing its armed forces over the past few years. It's been focusing on enhancing its maritime defense capabilities, crucial given its archipelagic nature and the maritime disputes it has with China. The Philippines' military might not be as vast or technologically advanced as India's or China's, but it holds a strategic geographical advantage in the South China Sea. Now let's look at China. China's military capabilities are formidable. It has the world's largest standing army, a rapidly modernizing navy, and an air force that's growing in size and sophistication. China also has a robust nuclear arsenal and a space program that adds another dimension to its military strength. When we consider the potential for combined military operations between India and the Philippines, it's clear that such an alliance could bring a unique mix of strengths. India's military power, combined with the Philippines' strategic location, could present a significant challenge to China. This alliance could lead to a more equitable distribution of military power in the region, which can deter unilateral aggressive actions. So, could this potential alliance shift the military balance of power in the region? It's a possibility that can't be dismissed and is certainly worth exploring further. What would be the implications of a Philippines-India alliance for the region? As we delve into the broader implications of such an alliance, we can't overlook the potential ripple effect it could have. An alliance of this magnitude would undoubtedly send a powerful message to other regional powers, likely prompting a variety of responses. On one hand, neighboring countries may see this alliance as a potential threat, leading to a regional arms race as they seek to strengthen their own military capabilities. On the other hand, it might serve as a wake-up call, pushing nations towards diplomatic solutions to regional disputes. Additionally, the international community would not remain indifferent. Western powers, such as the United States and the European Union, may view a Philippines-India alliance as a counterbalance to China's rising influence in the region. This could result in increased military and economic support, strengthening the alliance and its position on the international stage. However, we must also consider the potential for economic fallout. 
Trade relationships could be strained, particularly with China, who is a significant trading partner for both India and the Philippines. This could lead to economic repercussions, not only for these nations, but for the entire region. Furthermore, the creation of such an alliance could potentially alter the balance of power in the region. This shift could spark a realignment of alliances with countries reassessing their strategic partnerships based on this new geopolitical landscape. Yet despite these potential repercussions, there's a chance this alliance could serve as a stabilizing force. Amidst rising tensions, the formation of a strong Philippines-India alliance could discourage aggressive actions, fostering peace and stability in the region. In the face of rising tensions, could this alliance serve as a stabilizing force in the region? In conclusion, the alliance between India and the Philippines holds significant strategic potential, offering a robust response in hypothetical tensions with China. Subscribe for more amazing content. Keep wondering. Don't miss out on future explorations and discoveries. Hit subscribe and ring the bell to stay updated with our new content. Your journey of wonder continues with every video. Stay connected and engaged on social media. Continue the conversation, follow us. Thank you for being a part of the Have You Ever Wondered community. Keep wondering, keep discovering. Until next time.